Yeah, I don't look like I'm any rocks. That's sad. I wish I could. That'd be fun. Now, let's see what else we could fit there, possibly. Hmm. Oh, yeah, right here I was going to add some trees. Might as well do that now. Hey guys, if you didn't know, I now have a community server on Discord, and all you have to do to find it is type in Velociraptor 03's community server, although we do have rules, we have plenty of announcements like this one right here, for all of you being long-going subscribers, as you know, I used to do a series called Survival of the Fittest, this series will make a return in May, so I hope you guys are all excited about that. We also got some channel links. Co-owner Blake is the one who set this up for me, so great thanks to Blake or Sanessa Vlogs. And then we also got some video links, which will be posted for very good videos. And then we got some announcements for all the sections. New games, because I do plan on bringing new games to the channel in the future. And then we also got some chats, the general chat, we got a lot of stuff in here, and then we got game night and all that. And then this stuff down here, these are the offices, so I can't show you that. So yeah, if you guys want to join, make sure to go ahead and type it in and look it up. And I'll see you guys here in the video. Hey guys, welcome back to another video here today, and today... We are playing Jurassic World Evolution, as you guys probably already knew, but today is a special day. We are going to the last and final island of the campaign. Yes, you heard me right. We're going to the last island. I'm excited, yet sad that this is the last island. It's probably going to take the longest, too, though. And yours are exceptional. Thank you. But yeah, if we go here, if I get rid of that... <laughs> We can, um, go to islands, and, yeah. Oh, wait, no, this isn't the last island, because we also have to do Muerta East, and then we gotta do Takena Research Facility. So, yeah, that's gonna be a little bit different, though. It's fine, though. So, we're gonna head straight over to Isla Sorna. Here, oh, we, it go. Also, it's a relative turn to a cannery. A cat is a monster. We're just used to being the cat. This is Isla Sorna. You've got a larger landmass to deal with on this island. More opportunities for success, and uh, of course, for the unexpected, which uh, shouldn't be unexpected, but you know, it just always is. All right, here we go. An island Dr. Malcolm's all too familiar with, Site D. Long since reclaimed by nature, mostly. Mm -hmm. Taming this place will likely be your toughest challenge yet. And speaking of taming, <laughs> a number of wild attractions make up the local population. Full disclosure, some of them have very long and very sharp teeth. True. Do not let this place fool you. Like Central Park in New York City, what appears to be nature is actually an elaborate illusion. On this island, the dinosaurs are running wild. But that can't be true because they're contained, aren't they? Their situation and their existence is both artificial and real. A recursive nightmare. Like the dragon curve, a potentially dangerous Mendelbrot set. Fractal. Fraction. Fractured, all from the same root word, frangir, Latin for to break. So you see, creation and destruction are really one and the same. Well, okay, so as you guys were saying, I was blocking this guy off from getting to the herbivores, so now they should be fine, in my opinion. Um, 
And that gives us more room to expand already, too, so that's all good. Now, uh, our profit, I think, is actually going up because all the dinosaurs. Yes, it is. So we're actually getting money just because there are dinosaurs on the island. Now, I almost want to start fresh. But what I am going to do is I'm going to delete the walls for sure. Oh, whoops, that was a mistake. Oopsies. I made a boo-boo. Connect that up. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to do that. I'm meant to be deleting this wall. Because now there's no carnivores, so there's not much point for it. Well, no loose carnivores anyway. That uh, pack I, paddock I just put him in, he can easily get out of that. So we're going to have to be careful about that. But this is going to give us more building space, which is nice. Alright, there's a lot more building space now from just removing that. Okay. So this is the biggest chunk down here, or no way, actually, no, that's the biggest chunk, but I think we need to work on down here first, in my opinion. I sort of want to get a T-Rex. I'm already having that dream of the T-Rex. But, before we do that dream, we need to figure out where we're putting all of our ACU stuff. I'm thinking maybe to put it down up along this cliff right here. In fact, we're going to do that, actually. Hold on. Just remove these trees so I can see. I know I'm acting like I'm on a sandbox island right now, and I know that we're not. But hey, I just want—I just want to make my park look good. You know what I mean? <laughs> so yeah, this will just be all of our like ACU operative area right here. Okay, now we need water removed. Removal, please. Okay, it should be all removed. Now, if I go to here, I want to flatten it. Going across the edge to make sure it's good. Let me smooth it out real quick to make sure it don't look stupid. Okay, yep, that looks good. Alright. Now, if we come over here. We can build some of our buildings now. So this will be like our research area and all that. I'm going to start by putting down a ranger team. Of course there's not going to be any power to it or anything. I think that should be safer if I put them back here. Hold on, I'm forgetting how to play this game. Just be patient with me for a second here. <laughs> All right, so we got that. Um, next, since uh, I'm, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Where's my ACU center? I'm blind. I literally am blind. That should be good. All right, so we'll place that there, and then we'll place some of our other buildings along here too. So let's get a fossil center. Hmm. No, no, we need to build a bigger building first. We need to build the expedition center to start. There we go. Uh, so we're going to have to remove the, some of this water, it looks like, too. And then after we do that, we can flatten out some more of the terrain here. Because we want it to be flat as possible while we're building. Make sure it's a good flat area for us. And then if we go in here, we can also get a... Fossil center. These are the main ones I want for the island currently. There we go. Alright, and then what we're going to need from here is we're going to have to find a way to build down here. 
For now, I'm thinking we need to bulldoze the starting area because it doesn't look that good if we're all going to be truly honest. Sorry, guys. The park's not currently open. Come back later. Um, I actually should have probably kept the ACU, but it's fine. It's fine. Who cares? There may be no power in the park, but it's fine. I know that's going to bring down our money income a little bit, but I'm fine with it for now at least. So I figure out what I'm doing here anyway. So, to start with, I think we could do the, uh, you know the starting area from Jurassic World. I've just received reports oh, about the contract that. that's available. Looks like the kind of thing you can handle. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. But, uh, no, it's not. <laughs> Alright, so, where are they going? I'm looking at what they're doing. I'm just, I'm confused what they're doing. So if I grab this, I can actually sort of build the Jurassic World area up here. There, that looks good. So they should all go back towards the paths now. Yep. And then what I can do from here, I got to make sure it's all flat real quick though. Which, it actually seems pretty flat. I'm not sure if it is, though. Yeah, back here, it's not. It wasn't going to let me place that um, innovation center unless it was completely flat. Alright, I think we're good. Uh, we can go ahead and probably build the innovation center now. So, if we go to guess... No, wait, not guest. Operations. We can go to Innovation Center. Trying really hard. There we go. And then we also can do some guest buildings. I do, however, want to put a monorail station down, right, in the back here. I'm not sure how that's going to go, though, so we'll see you here in a second. Because these dinosaurs are probably going to hate me for doing this to them, but I am pushing the dinosaurs back. I sort of feel bad, but same time, I don't really feel bad because <laughs> I'm doing it for the park's best uh, being right now. So, if we go over, and we get a road, I'm trying to make this look nice, get, get, if you guys know what I'm saying, um, this is how I do it, I just build one out from it. Just keep going like that, and then to there, and then I'm trying to figure out. So, build to how many more tiles? That one, two, three, four. Oh, I accidentally clicked off. One, two, one, two, three, four. It's hard to tell. I think that's it. And then it'd be cool if we did it like that, in my opinion. Like that! There we go, that looks really cool. I like it. It makes it match up pretty well, if you know what I mean. Um, are we still bringing in money? I'm actually shocked. We're actually bringing in more money, but then again, we did just... 
do some stuff. I'm trying to build while I have the money coming in. But... So what I'm going to do... Is we'll put a restaurant right here. Straight across from the restaurant we shall build the... Um, this place. Next to that, we'll build a bowling arena. And then next to that, we can do a... Or next to this, I meant... Oh, no, that's not going to make it even then. I need to find a way to make it even. about roads real quick hold on a second I need to see how I can make that look better toy store isn't big enough hmm I'm trying to figure out which building I should use but yeah, guys, I'm probably going to time lapse this next little part. So you might. So, guys, I'm going to end the. I'll be right back in a second. I'm just going to stop it here. And then I'm going to continue it here in a second.
Hey guys, I am back, and yeah, we had a little storm there, so I had to jump in the ranger vehicle and come repair all this, but I am loving it. It's a beautiful start to island. I like how I put rocks around it. It gives it that little detail, and uh, yeah, uh, basically my idea was that I was going to put stuff in, but now I'm not sure exactly what my idea is, because... Everything has pretty much changed. Let me see if I can get some rocks in here real quick, because I'd love to see some giant boulders, but I don't think I, that's going to be possible. Because of the roads, mainly. If I could fit it like that, that'd be cool, but eh, I can't. That's sad. Um, it's sad. Oh, well. Wait, maybe I can do this one. Yeah, I don't look like I'm any rocks. That's sad. I wish I could. That'd be fun. Now, let's see what else we could fit there, possibly. Hmm. Oh, yeah, right here I was going to add some trees. Might as well do that now. <coughs> I sort of got a little cough. But, yeah. Hmm, won't let me build any of them for some reason. Sometimes you just gotta turn it a little and then it'll let you place it. There you go. Yeah, like, see here, there's nothing in the way. Oh, there it was. There. There you go. Unless it says, like, there's the tree next to it, like, blocking it or something. And you gotta just find that angle where you can place it. Down, like so. But yeah, what I was trying to do here is I was just trying to make it look really nice while you go to the monorail. Yeah, but yeah, uh, let me see. Is the uh, dinosaur... Yes, he is back in his pen. And guys, I don't know if you know this, but our money has skyrocketed just because of the main factor that we upgraded everything pretty much. <clears throat> now, there is one building I have not put down, and I almost totally forgot to do this. Uh, but yeah... This should be the last building, and it is in range, so when it's done building, it should be act available to us. I almost said act available. Um, I do want to actually change these to max people. Because literally, if you see this, like, we were almost at maximum consumption. The thing is, we have three hotels on the island. I don't think that's going to be uh, taken up anytime soon. We still don't see it being taken up anytime soon. Although this is a huge area, and there's a lot of people here. Even though they can't see the dinosaurs, there's a lot of people here, and we gotta be careful. Now, that storm <laughs> was really bad. I'm glad no one actually got hurt, so I was really relieved to see that. Um, I'm trying to change all the staff counts real quick. And guys, uh, not for this video, but for the next few videos, I'm trying a new software, which hopefully will work out for me pretty well. Okay, now we've got research options unlocked. I want to go in there and see what options we've unlocked, because if they're good ones, I'm probably going to do them straight off the bat. Let's see. Fossils, we have two available. We have the Nigersaurus. Oh yeah, we were doing stuff on the other island, so it's going right now. Let me see about the genetics. We got these three. We were, oh yeah, we were doing uh, Indominus Rex. Oh yeah, and then, oh yeah, these guys are going to be the fun ones to do. Especially this one. But yeah, okay, so if we go in here... 
I'm looking in here mainly because I was seeing all the new sites real quick. But it's fine. Okay, so I still gotta figure out what I'm doing down here. But for now, up here, the herbivores are getting a little close, so. Oh, I have an upgraded ACU down here! Oh crap, what am I doing? Upgrade, ACU, reload speed, please. Accuracy. And then just a lot of scheduling. I don't know how many dinosaurs are up here. Hold on. The Indominus Rex is a magnificent creature. If evolution had the time, well, we've just hurried things along a bit. And the result is nothing short of spectacular. So don't dilute the... Hold on. I need to open all, all emergency shelters. That's why I put them on opposite sides. Is in case if there's like a carnivore up here, they can run down here to this one. Okay, so this area is being evacuated because of dinosaurs. The finish line. I'll make sure I make a pin for the stegosaurs here in a second. I'll make this mainly a stegosaur pin because stegosaurs are very important, is La Sorna. But ACU, there is one more that you're not going to be able to get. Hopefully he'll be able to take them out rather quickly, because now they're panicking. People are still making their ways into the emergency shelters. These people have no clue what's going on. Like, oh, there's nothing going on, it's fine. They're lying. Okay, there's one of them down. Okay, so... i do this contract myself if I could. That's how good it is. Did I oversell it? No, you didn't, buddy. Don't worry about it. All right, so if we look at this, we have a better idea of when a storm is going to hit, then we should be able to sell more umbrellas, shouldn't we? That is true. Oh, the aviary, that'd be fun. And then we got drivable Jurassic tour. I'm going to research some of these now, so. Okay, so we got two of the stegosaurs down. We need I'm going to go ahead and transport one over to the other area because that area is short of one stegosaur right now. I think that's it, which... Oh yeah, there's four of them here. The thing is, I don't want them running over here and attacking this area because that would be really bad. Although there doesn't seem to be anyone there. Down here, the stegosaurs kind of are getting close to, so I mean... <sighs> Oh, their feeder's right there, so I mean, ah, oh, it's so hard to decide, but I think we should deal with them up here first. So, what we're going to start by doing, is I'm going to start by making them pin around all of this electricity cable and all that. So, I don't think I want it to be an electrified fence, though. Sorry, and then I'll make a uh, little gateway for the um, ranger teams to be able to go through still. I'm going to have to change this power area also. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this probably a Jurassic Tour ride. And I might put it right here where this emergency thing is. And then I'm going to go around like so, all the way back up to there. Alright. And then what we can do is we can put a gate over here in case we get sabotaged. And now what we can do, because I think, if I'm not mistaken, the feeder's in here. Yes, it is. Alright. Now what we can do is we can get all these guys transported in, even though you're already in, buddy. You still got to get transported. Put them all in here. What we can do is we can clear the trees in here. Like so. Let's clear all the brush so we can make it look beautiful here in a second. And also I might want to redirect power lines also, so I might go ahead and delete some poles here. Sorry, sorry, power's out. Just give it a second. And it'll be back on here soon. Don't worry guys, don't worry. I'm gonna fix it. I am now officially fix it Felix. <laughs> Alright, so 
There we go, we fixed the power issue. Oh, wait. There we go. Oh, yeah, I haven't turned off all emergency shelters. Hold on. Guys, guys, you're fine now. It's fine. Did I transfer that one? Yeah, it says six are in transportation currently. Uh, that one's almost there where the agitated guys are. I want to make them happy. But when the next stork storm comes, I'm telling ACU to take out that Spinosaurus straight away. We're running low on food all over the park, so I might just get Ranger Team. I'm going to tell Ranger Team to go around the entire park real quick and resupply every single feeder. If I can reach this one. And then I'll tell them to come back over here and do this one. Let's see. They're losing it because there's not enough forest for them currently. And wait. Oh yeah, you got, your friend isn't in yet, so you're a little bit sad. Hold on, allow me to remove the water real quick. Guys, so yeah, there you go. Sorry about that, buddy, but I need to remove it so I can do this. So, how I'm going to set up this pen is I'm going to make it sort of a stream-like thing right here. And then there's, like, a small area down here. And then there's, like, a small area up here. So, it's more like a doggy bone than it is anything, if I'm going to be truly honest. But, with that being said, I also want to make it look very nice with this. Because it's my first pen, and you gotta make your first pen look nice when you build it. Oh, how lovely! A disease was contracted. Who was it? I'm not sure who, uh, if it's... Oh, it's all the way. Let me drive you real quick, buddy. I'm gonna just go off for a second. I'm gonna shoot whoever's sick. I see them, they're like... Oh, is it this guy? Drive! And that's what I was worried about. Oh no. Let's get you out of here real quick, buddy. Um, Maybe I should get ACU on this. I've never had ACU go on a Medicaid mission. <gasps> oh wait, it's something I don't have researched? <laughs> You're kidding. No. Okay, so we're gonna have to research Salmonola. I want all these researched. Uh, can I? Oh, I can't cancel it. Crud! I just researched the wrong thing. I researched every single one but some okay Salmon how low is his health already? Oh, it's, oh I'm gonna get in our ranger team. Oh wait, this ranger team. Uh da, da, that one delete it. You're going straight over, buddy. I am gonna take this other ranger team up there and I'm gonna try to see if I can help these dinosaurs out. It's so difficult to like Maintain the dinosaurs, make sure they don't attack your range of vehicles and all that, especially on a new island with dinosaurs. I'm glad I put a very nice park up so far. Oh, I just saw something. Uh-oh. 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 Uh you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and put in forest. It's fine. This is temporary. Remember, Stegosaurus, this is temporary forest for you. Just make sure you don't get angry. <laughs> You get angry at me for that, Stegosaurus. I'm gonna kill you, buddy. Drive. No, I don't want you going that way. We need to go this way. We need to hurry. Before that dinosaur dies. When I see the first medical research done, I'm gonna freaking go straight after it. I see it.
Oh, they think I'm trying to trank it, but... I just helped him out. He's probably back at, like, max health almost already, so... Ah! It's gonna spread like a wildfire if I don't get under control. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's back it up a little bit more to make sure we don't get attacked. Far enough so they don't attack us. ACU, I would love it if you if we could get that research done. Research, what's taking you so long? Okay, in we go, in we go, research. I need to make sure none of them are low on health. Okay, one of them's on 67 health. I gotta get this guy going. It's that one. That should help him out. Back it up, back it up. Let's move out, move out, move out, move out. I don't want to get attacked. So we're going to back it up. I thought I said new idea for a second. I'm like, are you kidding me right now in my head? So, he's at 70, he's at 8. Oh my gosh, this is like a wildfire. And I got, I'm got. i going to have to constantly shoot him. Now there's three of them. How lovely. Shoot you. Shoot you. Shoot you. I should keep them all at max health for now. But the the disease brings down their health extremely quickly. Hopefully I don't think I'm pushing them out of their territory right now because I'm not. It's going to take so long to research and these guys are running. Wait. 78, 72, 93. Okay. So they look pretty good right now. They're not die dead. They're not dead. Let's put it that way. Yeah, you can go back to base. I think your job's done, basically. The salmon oil eye is almost researched. Now we are just waiting for the medicine to come in. Pretty much. Come on. Okay, all four of them are being tranked. We need at least two vehicles out here to help with that. Okay, so I sent out another ranger team, which is going to help with it. Because seriously, we need someone else to do it. We cannot have any dinosaurs die. Not on my watch! There's one at 62% and 67. 67 is going to get hit first. This is like serious, so I'm going to tell this guy to even go help. Hold on, wait. There's another one right there. 91 is going to be hit last. This guy's hitting second with this other one. Hopefully he'll be able to cure him. Yeah, he's been hit. He's been hit once. That's good. No, are you kidding me? Not another another one is freaking sick. Okay, one's down. That's one sick dice are cured. One dice or sick that was sick is now cured. Okay, they're all being cured currently. That's two down. Three left, and there's none across the park anyway, so that's good. And guys, I think after we cure them, we're going to end the episode here. But yeah, it's been lovely, hasn't it? One more, and all the vehicles are here to take it on. Okay, they're taking it on. Alright, sweet. But yeah, guys, hope you guys you did enjoy that live, or... Excuse me. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the um, time lapse of me uh, making this small area right here. It looks beautiful from up here. It's not really beautiful, though. I know it. It's, it's hideous. But anyways, guys, if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell if you truly did. 
And yeah, if you guys are have been here for a while, I'm trying a new editing software with this video. So bye!